What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. We are doing more Dead Rising 2 today, and we're finishing this game today, so this may... It may be a longer video. I don't know. By the way, I am still a little sick. I never mentioned I was sick on YouTube, but I got sick the other day. Uh, I still have a bit of a leftover cough. Shut up, phone. I still have a bit of a leftover cough. Um... Not only that, I get a little bit of a phlegm buildup in my throat, but it's whatever. We move on. I ain't letting it stop me. I'm here to make content. I'm here to make a long-ass video on Dead Rising 2. I don't know how long it's going to be, but we're about to find out. So, obviously, if you don't remember what happened in the last episode, everything was going well. It looked like everybody was finally about to get an escape because Rebecca was going to call her crew. And when she was going to call her crew, she was going to get a evac there they were gonna save her they were gonna save every survivor but then sullivan was like nah let me let me stop you right there and he pops a gunshot in her head killing her on the spot and everyone gets to learn that sullivan has always been the bad guy so right now we're actually after sullivan which uh i'm not a big fan of fighting sullivan he's kind of annoying let's kick some ass but i don't necessarily care either he, he's fine but we're definitely gonna go get some uh oh shit i've lost them do you see him anywhere no i'll keep an eye on these monitors i'll keep looking i do not remember where he went honestly I just got a little bit of a lag spike there, but whatever. As y'all know, I still have a little bit of an older gaming laptop with an older gaming graphics driver. I'm happy with it. It gets the job done. It records, but from time to time, there's a little bit of a, a lag that happens. I ain't really too concerned. Uh, I ain't too concerned about it. Because it's either I can bitch, moan, and complain, or I can be happy with what I got and get something better down the line. Right now, we got a guy to focus on that's been causing nothing but problems behind our backs. Oh, shit. Oh, God, God. Oh, sweet Jesus. By the way, I want to mention this in this video. Next year, I'm planning something big. Maybe not big to everyone. Some people may be like, ah, it's just a minor change. Nobody really cares. But for those of you who've known me a long time, known the things I've talked about, and known the way I am, next year is hopefully going to be big. 2023 has been a little rough so far. I'm hoping the ending of the year is good. I'm trying to get a different job. Man, I hate phlegm buildup in the throat. I really do. But, I killed this guy. Nobody likes him. Oh, God. Anyway. 2023 has been a little bit rough. I'm hoping the ending of the year will go smoothly, or at least the rest of the year. And then, um, next year, I'm really looking forward to next year, honestly. Can y'all stop chasing me and trying to puke on me? Please, go away. I beg of you. Leave me. It's like they want nothing but problems nowadays. So I think we gotta go into the Yucatan Casino. I feel like if I laugh, I'm going to cough out a left lung, and I don't want to do that right now. Or at least a lung in general. I don't know what side lungs are on, honestly. I don't know much about the anatomy of the human body. Nor do I really care. I just don't want to cough. It feels like shit. Luckily, got me some Gatorade to hopefully suppress that feeling. If I do cough and it sounds terrible, I'm sorry. I'm really trying my hardest to not cough, but if it comes out, it comes out. It's not something I can really help right now. <coughs> oh, man. It's like the phlegm got stuck. Jesus. Yeah, probably not something... Oh, my goodness! Probably not something anybody really wants to hear when I'm playing a game like Dead Rising 2, but... Whatever. I believe we go up here, right? Yep. Die. Kill all these zombies. 
Oh yeah. Now we go up to the Yucatan Casino rooftop. So I, I did enjoy this series a lot. I'm in, this may be the beginning of the last episode. But oh my Jesus, get off of me. Oh, we gotta be jumping today. Oh, she's on my cock. Oh my god, they're everywhere. Need this cocktail. Alright. What the fuck? No! Oh, yes. That's a fish. I want that fish. Alright, so as y'all can tell, there's a... A uh, load of zombies in this area. And I just hurt myself. I, I'm such an idiot. Quit slapping me. I'm not your bitch. Oh my god. Holy shit. Get off of me. These zombies must think I'm their pimp because they're slapping me. And I, they think I'm a hoe in it or something. I'm not. I'm a good little Christian boy playing Dead Rising 2. Cursing at the top of my fucking vocabulary because the, mo the majority of the words I know are fucking shit and piss and this and that. I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. Nobody ever does. So you're behind this. You killed all these people for money. After everything that's happened, that's what you think? The money's secondary. We're trying to save lives here, Chuck. Saving lives? What the hell are you talking about? Oh, come on. We had to take the necessary steps to ensure a consistent supply. We can't make the drug without queens, Chuck. A lot of queens. You can thank Isabella for that. And TK looting the city? But that's not about money? He went off the rails. He was well paid for his part. He just got greedy. His work, not ours. Whatever happened to do no harm, Sullivan? Open your eyes, Chuck. Do you have any idea how many people are affected in this country? Doctors, politicians, CEOs. Some of our country's best are infected. Even your little girl, Chuck. What would happen to your cute little time bomb? She didn't get her drugs. Fortune City was a small price to pay to ensure our country's way of life. You murdered these people. Acceptable losses. This wasn't the first time and it won't be the last. You bastard. You did it. You caused the Vegas outbreak too, didn't you? You killed my wife, destroyed my family. Everything that we have done has been absolutely necessary. I don't think that's necessary but oh geez get away from me so i'm gonna eat this fish real quick and then we're gonna go oh my goodness i should have seen that coming all right oh good god get away from me fucking god But no, he really sucks fighting. Jesus. Oh my god. Oh my god, the undead. Quit shooting me, you bastard! Fuck! You know, you're a real piece of shit, Sullivan. You're a real asshole. You're a real piece of garbage. Yeah, this is why I don't like Sullivan, because he has a bunch of um, very dirty little uh, maneuvers that he does in order to win these fights. See, I can't even fucking hit him. That's so trash. I, I gotta... My God! I'm not dying here. This ain't happening. No, give me this. Give me this shit. My goodness. So as y'all can see, this fight, it's pretty bullshit. Get the fuck away from me. So I need to go grab more food within this area. Gonna grab this lobster. Gonna grab this fish. Uh, there's no other food in here. 
Can you get off my dick, woman? This isn't an all-you-can-eat buffet. Get off of me. So the infected here are really obnoxious. Very obnoxious, because it's a small area, and there's loads of them within this area. Meaning, it's going to be quite problematic getting through this, because of how many there are. But before I even go to fight him all the way, I need to get as much food as I can without taking as much damage. Which doesn't seem to be going well. Which is not good. Can I jump up here? Jesus. Alright. I need to, um... You see, look at this. They're just fucking everywhere. It does not matter where you go in this uh, area. The amount of infected are asinine at most. Fuck you. And fuck you. Now, I have to really think here, right? Because definitely this could always go bad. This could be very, very bad. Now, the fortunate thing here... So, using weapons isn't a good idea. You want to jump kick him, because you need to use physical force. But he likes to dodge a lot. And it's like, you have to be very, very consistent when you're fighting Sullivan. Really? Oh my god, man. Oh my god. See, that's so bull. Holy crap. Now the fortunate thing is we're doing damage to him. But we're not hitting him. It's not connecting. Now obviously I have to be smart here. I have to evade for a quick minute and I have to go heal. Because if I don't it's game over and it's just going to be going poorly honestly. Alright. We don't need it. Now, I don't remember what button it is, but there's a button where I can just pull out my fists. I just don't remember what button is what. And that is gay. Not in a good way, either. Oh, no. What? Now, I think there is something else we can do, too. No, we can't. Okay, the drop kick does pretty good damage to him, too. So we need to drop kick him. He's still hitting, though. He's still swinging. I missed. Hard. There we go. That's much better. So, as long as we keep drop kicking him and we try to avoid his attacks, maybe we might be okay here. Ah, oh, shit. Yep. Look at that. Oh, 
Oh yeah, one more hit. Maybe one to two at most. And we're good. Yep, one more. One more. Fuck you. Screw you, Sullivan. Six Action News. This is Chuck Green. You want the scoop of a lifetime? There's a bunker full of survivors in Fortune City. And I've got the proof of what happened here. I need rescue choppers. And I need them right now. Fuck Sullivan. Honestly, not my favorite fight in this game. He's, he's very low when it comes... Okay. So, those guys are safe, whatever, I don't care about them, but, like I was saying, Sullivan is not very fun to fight, at least not for me. Now we ain't done yet. We are not. But it says save and continue, right? We're gonna save it over here on the facts, and we're not done yet. <laughs> Excuse me.
So TK has kidnapped our beloved daughter and, well, Katie. Hang in there, kiddo. But yeah, we have to go save Katie. And we have to save Stacy from the wrath of TK. That's pretty much what happens when you save TK, though. Like, you give him Zombrex. Bad things happen. Now, you're the only one in here, and you have to uh, get a list of items. And when you get these items, then you have to confront TK. And then, unfortunately, he stuns you, takes all your shit, and it's never really fun, is it? No, it's not. But, when you get through it, you get the true, and in my opinion, the best ending of the game. But, it's also not going to be the end of the video, because we're going to restart the game. And when we restart the game, we're going to get the ending once again. And once we get that ending, where we don't give TK Zombrex, then, uh... We get the other ending. And there's other endings too. Because Dead Rising has a bunch of endings. So does the original game. And so does this game. Am I getting all of them in this video? No, I am not. The reason I'm not. Is because that would take a little bit too much time. And I'm not really interested in putting in all that time. While I feel this type of way. Where I'm still getting over a bit of a sickness. It's never fun to be sick, by the way, folks. And... Jesus! I'm also ready to be done with this game as a whole as well. Get away from me! You sick bitch. Alright, compromising photo. Fuck you. Holy shit. Actually, give me that. That's... Zombies, 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 zombies. Now I have something you want. And I'm going to take out a crowd of you for the fun of it. Also, we got to get a little bit more cash as well. Jesus. Let's just use it on this little crowd here. There we go. Now we gotta go get the gift basket. I don't remember where that is, but we're just gonna follow the arrow, get everything in the order that it picks for us. And then we're gonna move on with the game. Then we're gonna beat TK and finish what we started. But obviously, there's also like still, even though I'm level 50, even though I have a shit ton of experience on this game, I'm not going to take risks and die the TK and have to redo everything all over. So before we fight TK, I'm definitely saving. Because I think it's for the best that I save my game and then go for, in my opinion, one of the more difficult fights in the game. Because, uh, well, it's not too difficult because you can get weapons, just... There's some bullshit that goes on with it. It's whatever. I guess he's not the hardest. I think Sullivan might even be a little bit more difficult than TK. But, does not matter. So we're getting pretty close to the gift basket, because I think it's in here. Yeah, it's near the, the front of the South Plaza area, where we entered and met Rebecca. The fact it's been um, five months since I started this playthrough, and I took a break for over three months, and came back. And now we're finally finishing up the game. Uh, it's quite sad. I'm kind of inconsistent when it comes to my series. I just, for that three-month period, I was not happy. I was not enjoying life like I should have. So I definitely took more time off than I needed. I love uploading on YouTube, though. It's always been one of my preferable hobbies. Because I enjoy commentating. I enjoy playing video games and getting some content on the internet to enter. Oh my god! Man, they love grabbing these nuts, man. Give me that gift basket. Jesus! Freeze them! We freeze zombies here. 
Alright. I'm just gonna eat these small items here. Some fries. A burger, and we should be fully healed up. I'm also gonna take this coffee creamer. And we're gonna get the expensive champagnes. I think I've had champagne once. I do like champagne. It's, it's really nice. I'm not a big alcohol guy. I don't even know if champagne is alcohol. I believe it is, but... Correct me if I'm wrong. I think there's non-alcoholic champagne. I don't remember. I'm not exactly a professional drinker where I know my stuff like that either, so... Whatever. Get off of my shoulder! But we have to go get TK some expensive champagne. Now, the thing I don't understand is why the fuck does TK need all these ingredients when it's just setting up a fight, he's not going to be using any of these items. The only thing I can guess is he wants to make Chuck use a lot more of his energy running around and grow- Holy shit! That's a lot of those in, uh, special infected right there. But I'm guessing he wants Chuck to use up a ton of his energy so when he actually confronts Chuck, Chuck is a little bit more on the weaker side, making the fight easier for TK to win over Chuck. But as y'all know, Chuck is a champ and uh, we will prevail. I don't think, I, I was in the wrong area. My bad. Once again, me and my stupidity. Now we're pretty close. It's over here, right? Yeah. Yeah, there it is. All right. Now we got to get a case of queens. If I'm correct, the case of queens is in the uh, underground railway area. It's where that science lab bullshit is. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, come on. I'm doing something, man. Paddle saw. Cool. Assault rifle? I want. My goodness. God, the special infected are beyond annoying because they're a lot stronger, a lot quicker, and they just suck. Like I said, we're more likely in my least favorite part of the game territory. I really enjoyed the beginning. Because you get to just kill zombies, do missions. If you don't even want to do missions, you can just kill zombies in so many ways. And it's fun. <laughs> Fucking bitch. I got the buttons mixed up. Alright. Now I have to go make more weapons because I broke my combo weapons. How unfortunate. Does not matter though. <laughs> uh, actually, yeah, it does. I only have an assault rifle and I'm not wasting over 40 bullets to take down one special infected. We're going to go around here. Let's grab a drink cocktail. My goodness, go away! Leave me! Oh my god! I feel like a celebrity being chased by paparazzi at this point. Oh my god! It's terrible, they're on my ass every fucking second. It's beyond obnoxious. It's like you have no seconds to breathe when you're running around the mall anymore. Now, a positive thing is we don't really need weapons. Wait, what? Oh, we can go this way. Yeah. Oh, I can make a weapon, though. Oh! I haven't made this yet, and I'm going to make this. I don't think I've made this. I don't recall. Right on. Never mind. I, I guess I have. We're also going to make this too, even though this one kind of sucks, but it's whatever. It's strong. It's just, it doesn't last long at Let's all. Do this. 
For example, let me do it on one zombie. It's at 100%. 80. Look at that. It's like you can use it on five zombies. If you're careful. But yeah, it, it sucks. I think that's a shitty combo weapon. Um, whatever though. These burnt boxing gloves though, those are really good. Because even though it doesn't look like they do much at first, it, it does light them on fire and eventually they die. I'm going to go in here for a minute and see if there's any other things I can grab. Uh, no, it does not seem like it. Well, there's the high, the blast frequency gun, but I don't remember what I can combine that with. I'm going to break open some cardboard boxes, see what goodies we can get. A box of nails. Got a steel chair. I can go WWE up in this bitch. Going to eat some fries. Pasta. Oh, this is what we want. If I can even open it. And we got a queen. I will keep the queen. Brand man, breaking those open though. Oh, there we go. The, bra the blast frequency gun is also really good on the special infected too, if I'm correct. So two shots. I will take a Bowie knife. Come on. Uh, it's kind of underwhelming. Now we need to get up here. This kind of sucks, honestly. There we go. Case of Queens. Sorry, Chuck. Sometimes you just got to take a little bit of fall damage. But I'm not done here yet. I want to look for more weapons. Never mind. It fell. It wasn't really worth it in the first place, honestly. I will take the machete. And we're going to break these open. Got the Merc Assault Rifle. Hold on. Sorry about that. Got a little busy something happened for a moment. But, now we need to go get a mobile headset for TK. Once again, I question, why does he need these things? I don't exactly know. But I also got a little hungry while I was out, and I definitely uh, got me this salad. Definitely got to eat a little healthier from time to time, so I decided to get me a salad, some croutons. Has a Caesar dressing on it. You always got to have a little bit of a healthier snack every once in a while. I need to eat more healthy on the daily, honestly. I need to get into more healthy eating habits. I feel like once I do that, I'll really be happier as a person. I could still eat unhealthy from time to time, just not 24-7. Oh, this gun is actually, like, godly against those things. So against the special infected... God damn! What about against these guys? Okay, so this is good against the special infected, but it's kind of worthless on normal zombies. Wow! I never noticed that, mainly because I used it on one zombie as a kid. And after I used it and I noticed it didn't work, I was like, yeah, I'm never going to use it again. But... I always thought there was some reason for it. There was always something to it. Now, I fully understand that reasoning. So, where is this mobile headset at? It's over here. It's over here somewhere. Ah... Okay. The USB drive. Is... Oh, man. We have to go down here. Why? Alright. I need to take a bite of this salad, honestly. Because I am 
really hungry right now. I have I've only had like a cup of cinnamon toast crunch this morning and there's no milk cuz we're poor. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. I'm going to combine this with this. Cool. There's this. I can also do this, but I might as well. I'm just not going to use it often because um, Killer. Chuck will puke. And when Chuck pukes, everything goes downhill from there. Is there a... There it is, yeah. I am not taking any chances walking in a crowd of these hooligans. These he... These heathens, whatever. So I'm taking this. Gotta just... Back it up a little. I am an excellent driver. That's a lie. If I ever drove a car, I'd probably crash into a telephone pole and... Be like, I just don't know what went wrong. I'd be like derpy. Cause I, I would just not know what goat wrong. I, Cause I have no idea what the hell I'd be doing. Luckily it's not, wait, wait, wait. Okay, it is this way. I was about to say, why did the arrow go straight? Why did I have to go around? Oh Jesus. Oh, coffin coming. <coughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. I am again. Now I need to get a lab suit. Holy. I feel like Jeff Hardy. They're gonna grab me! I'm not getting grabbed by these terrible, terrible things. Now I gotta go get a lab coat. Wish I had the dirt bike. It'd be a lot faster to get to where I need to go. There's also this right here. And I'm going to go in here because I want to make more combo weapons. Also, luckily, the thing is like right there, so that's a positive too. Dynamite. What do I combine dynamite with? Alright. Can I combine it with this? No. Sorry. Um, what, what do I combine dynamite with? No? I don't remember. I know you can combine it with flesh. Oh, I know a weapon I can make. I might as well do this. I might as well. Gonna do a parasol and a leaf blower. This is a very interesting weapon. All right, we gotta go up here. Gotta take another bite of my salad because I gots to eat. I gots to eat because I am hungry. Okay. I took an awfully big bite of that one. Oh, it's uh, over here where we saved Denise. Yeah, I just decided to use that for a minute. I don't really want it. Now! We return to the arena. 
That's it, Chuckles. You got it all. Now get to the arena and we'll talk about if these girls are going to walk away. I don't remember. I d that's what I thought it said for a second, but... I couldn't read it fast enough because I'm getting attacked at every angle. Alright, hold on. Hold on, TK. No! No! Alright. Sorry, got tied up. That's it, Chuckles. You got it all. Now get to the arena and we'll talk about if these girls are going anywhere. Alright. Man, the, the infected are just not fun to deal with today. No, they are not. I am not having a great time. Luckily, I would save here, but there's no point. Now, the funny thing is anything in our inventory right now is good for now. But it's about to be rendered completely useless. So it does not matter what I have. Man, my, th my everything is awful today. Not really awful, but man, it's like the phlegm in the throat, everything. Got a stuffy nose. Slight cough. That's just that time of the year. My body. We also live in Ohio. I live in Ohio too. So the weather kind of like continuously keeping on fluctuating back and forth between cold and hot and cold and hot. It ain't fucking helping, is it? It just makes me feel so awful sometimes. I need to hurry up and use this a few times. Now I'm gonna go save. Over here. And then when I save, we can now go fight TK. Gonna use this gun real quick, and we're gonna drink this. The slaughter up in this bitch. Gotta get rid of these weapons. I don't need a special weapon. That's how I feel, Chuck, when it comes to these infected, man. All right. Drinking too much will make Chuck sick. That's why I haven't used the one thing yet. <laughs> but we're about to. Jesus. They just don't stop. They never do. They just crave the flavor of Chuck Green. Now, let me use this. Drop. Fuck! I knew it. Alright. You took three drinks, Chuck. You took three. Come on, step up. Step up and fight, homie. Fucking bullshit. Come on. Yeah. Knocked out. Yeah, go ahead, Chuck. Get it out. Get it out of your system. It's okay. Now we throw everything else. <laughs> Got the final kill right there. So our final count for this playthrough is 2,379 zombies. Play it 
Now we gotta fight this asshole. And he's not exactly the most fun to fight either, because he does some some sketchy shit. Here we go. <laughs> Damn. Kiss my ass. How about you suck these nuts? Shit, my microphone is falling! Everything is going wrong! I did that! What the fuck? What? I'm moving my mouse! This game sucks! My God. Hang on. Oh, my God. I got to grab health. Or I'm fucked. Oh, this is bad. I gotta heal as much as I can. This is not looking good. Come on, TK. Oh, we won.
There we go. We beat it. We beat the game. Want to hang around here all day or get out of here? It's over. We're going home. I forgot about the jump scare there. Oh yeah. So here's our summary here. As you can see, the uh, prestige points earned over 2 million. And our total PP is 10 million. It's awesome. We are going to overwrite slot 3. Because we got to go back to slot 1. There's some stuff we have to do. So... We're not done yet. We have to go here. Load this up. And then we have to redo everything. Which sucks, but it's whatever. We're going to do our only lead. Once again. So, what do we do for the only lead again? Underground tunnels. I need the source of this gas. Okay. This is going to suck, meaning we have to go through this again. We have to beat Sullivan again. I don't want to beat Sullivan again, but it happens. Sometimes we got to beat Sullivan again. Not much we can do about that. It would have been nice if I could have just been like, ah, it's the end of the video. Nope, we got to get the other ending. Because I said I was going to. There's no point in giving up now when I've already come this far. There we go. Now, we have to do the only lead. Which shouldn't be too hard at all. But I'm guessing it's a little quicker if we go this way. So instead of it... I meant to hit E on the door, but I'm okay with picking up a big-ass newspaper box and hitting some zombies with it. It happens. Incoming cough. <coughs> oh. My my diet doctor Kel. I don't know. Can I have this, sir? Can I have these spare ribs? Can I have these spare ribs? Can I have the spare ribs? Oh. My inner autism came out. I had to get the spare ribs, but it gave me a stupid ass pistol. Nobody wants the pistol in this game. And you get off of me, butt crack liquor. God, I didn't hit the button in time. Ah! I'm hitting the wrong buttons! Wrong buttons! Fuck! S W A S D, Jesus. My goodness! Why am I hitting the wrong buttons now? I was doing so good earlier. You quit biting me, woman. God damn. Once again, 
really sick of the ending of this game. Really sick of the zombies. Jesus. This is just absurd. The amount of bullshit you gotta go through with this part is just beyond absurd. I fucking hate it. Ha! Huh. Terrible. Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. Please get away from me. I'm getting really sick of you fucking special infected. Oh my goodness. This game, man. This game is just fucking loves me. What the fuck? Stop! Oh, okay. I don't remember doing that, but I'll take it. Actually, you know what? No! My good God. Give me that. Give me these ribs. I need to go find more health pronto. I think this game hates me. Give me that vodka. Like holy heebie jeebie halabibi. I don't I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Once again, I never know what the fuck I'm talking about. I'm probably one of the dumbest guys on YouTube, but yet that's what makes me different. That's what makes me built different because I'm built like an absolute dumbass. How exactly is one built like an absolute dumbass? I can't tell you. Once again, getting really sick of you fucking zombies trying to eat my ass. Where Is it saying I need the go- I'm trying to move! I was holding W and it wasn't moving! I'm going to need to get a new keyboard soon. I need to get a new everything, honestly. I hear gunshots, or was that a zombie falling? Might have been either or. Where do I go from here? Ah, over here. Okay. Alright, we don't need to see this cutscene. We've already seen it. Oh, no. I just realized, though, I have no food on me. No health. This is my only shot. That's not what I wanted. It'll do. We'll make work out of it, though. Oh, 
Oh, yes. That's lovely. All right, let's kill some fucking mercenary guys. I'm just running at you. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Oh, I'm dead, yeah. I'm going to die! Hamburger, now! Jesus, fuck! God! Fucking... Fuck everything. Fuck that. I wish there was an option to just grab alcohol and spill it on their bodies. Because that's what I would do. I want guns. I want their guns. I'm going to take their guns. Right here and right now. I also need to find some health because I am low. I'm going to eat these fries. Even though it only heals me by like one point. One point is better than no points. Oh, whiskey. And pasta. Get this out of here. Give me that pasta. There we go. I'm fully healed. And we're going to try to kill the dudes in here with plates. Because that's the fun thing to do. Oh, yeah. One done. Oh wait, we don't need to see this. What am I doing? <laughs> Alright. I'm dropping these plates down because they're going to be useless the rest of the game. Now, we need to go back to the safe house. Get Rebecca shot in the head. After she gets shot in the head, we have to go beat Sullivan. And we're not giving TK any uh, Zombrex. We're not giving him any. All right. So we're getting pretty close to the safe house. <clears throat> Man, the phlegm is getting really, really hard to deal with from time to time. It's like I feel it, like, clogging up my throat. Saving a little bit of time. I'm trying to speed run this the best I can. How about we wear some white high heels so we can feel a little pretty on our adventure? I don't mind feeling a little pretty. Don't you guys and gals out there want to feel just a little bit prettier? I know I do. That's why I'm wearing these beautiful light high heels I stole from the store. Now, before we go fight Sullivan, I'm going to drop every weapon. And I'm going to load up my thing. Well, I'm going to keep one weapon for the infected, but... I'm going to fill up my inventory with food. So I don't have to worry about losing much. I don't know. These guns are practically going to be useless until I get there. Or at least when I get the Sullivan, they're kind of useless. And I'm getting really sick of the stuff he knows, too. It's not fun. It's beautiful out. Everything is great outside. The weather is lovely now, and my nose just cannot handle it. Now this is where you become an asshole, buddy. 
And we're not saving you, TK. We got it. We obviously got to skip. It ain't worth it. It's not worth the time. Now, positively, now we can just uh, keep going. We're going to continue playing. Guess we could kill a few zombies on the way until I load up my inventory full of goodies. Because it's time to go fight Sullivan once again. And once we fight Sullivan due to the fact TK has not been given Zombrex. Got anything? Yes, I know he headed that way. Thank you. Appreciate it. You're a very kind gal. I don't need... Uh, I'm just going to keep... Um... Yeah, we're good. Now we just go load up on stuff. We don't need this cutscene. Now let me go grab some goodies. I'm going to eat the brownie because they don't heal much. Alright, coffee creamer. Coffee creamer heals quite well. So I will load up on coffee creamer. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. 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 Oh, we, we, we avoid those. Oh yeah, we do. Am I cool? No, fuck you too. Oh, oh. I got hit, but oh. We lose those. <laughs> we lose those. They win that exchange because they smack me. Showing I can't avoid those. Now we gotta go to the Yucatan Casino. Casino. We got some good food in our inventory though. That's good. That's a positive sign right there. You know, I'm gonna go through here instead. I'm also gonna go back into the into Roy's Mart, which is a pharmacy, I believe, and there's goodies in here too. Oh yes. I want all the goodies. One more orange juice. We are set for Sullivan. It's time to go take on this man head on. And if I ever run out of food over there, I don't need to worry because there's also going to be food in the fighting area. But I should be good. I just got to focus on drop kicking him. That's all I got to do. I'm pressing W once again. It wasn't doing anything. Maybe it's because I'm pressing W immediately as upon joining, so it's like, it's not counting it as being pressed or something. I don't know. Y'all tell me. And you get off me. You're not even special. You're just a fat guy who got infected and died. I mean, rest in peace. Nobody wants to go out that way, but it doesn't make you special. Those guys are special because... They're built different, and they're ugly as fuck, and they're just very, very hard to deal with. Especially when there's hordes of them. Oh, dear God. Hordes of those things are just not something you want to go against. Oh, yeah. Holy shit. Now we're getting close to Mr. Sullivan once again. No! Give me that. Yeah, I know he's trying to go to the roof. You don't have to call me to tell me that. Well, I guess she does, doesn't she? Yeah. I wasn't thinking about it. I was putting video game and real life logic together and it just, it wasn't adding up. Holy, this fight is not 
going to be fun once again. I mean, due to the fact I already have a little trick up my sleeve, maybe it shouldn't be that bad. I need to jump. I need to jump as much as I can. Away from me! Oh, yeah. Oh, we avoid him. Why are you slap? <laughs> we don't need to see this. We already saw this at the beginning of the episode. Now, now, I know what I got to do here. I'm going to heal one little health with this. All right. Now it's time to go fight Sullivan. What? He already, he already took a little bit of damage. What did he do? Uh-oh, we don't like that. Screw you, you old man. No! Oh my god! Kick him in the face! Oh yeah, we're doing way better this time around. Oh yeah, we're doing good this time. Alright, maybe not so good. We're missing a ton of kicks. Now we're hitting some kicks. That's good. Gotta wait until that little animation there. How did that not hit him? I just killed you. What do you mean? Might as well watch this just to feel that satisfaction of him dying. <coughs> We're the good guys, Chuck. Not you. Oh, that's satisfying. Look at that. Nobody likes Sullivan. Nobody likes him. So I'm glad he's gone. Fuck that guy. Now.
Unable to effectively deal with the Fortune City outbreak, the U.S. government dispatched a squadron of bombers to level Fortune City, erasing all traces of life, both alive and undead. A convoy of civilian media choppers managed to rescue the safe house survivors shortly before the bombing. Thanks to the evidence and testimony presented by Stacy Forsyth, Chuck Green was cleared of all charges against him and lauded as a hero for exposing the Phenotrans conspiracy. Chuck Green, the man, however, was never heard from again. Whether he succumbed to zombies, was killed in the subsequent firebombing, or somehow managed to escape is unknown. The Fortune City outbreak came in time to be known itself as Fortune's End. Despite the controversy, the price of Phenotrans shares continued to rise. And that's it! That is the game! I believe this is a Cell Dweller song, isn't it? I'm trying yes! To drown the oh, I love this song, man. I believe it's called Kill the Sound. It's so good. Try to shut it down, but it grows ever loud. Two voices in my head, and I want one of them dead. So I can focus on remembering the words you said. Kill the sound, foundations trembling. These voices deafening. Feels like I'm running out of time. I need to help.
Oh man, that song is nostalgic, but I don't know, I wanted to play a bit of it. I wanted to play the song, but I wanted to play a bit of the credits to respect the people because this has always been one of my favorite games growing up. I remember I didn't see my dad for like the first 10 to 13 years of my life. And when I started seeing him again, he had an Xbox 360. And I played this game on that Xbox 360. And I had a lot of memories growing up playing this game thanks to my dad. And there will be videos on this in the future because me and Red, Red Griffin, wanted to do multiplayer, which would be pretty fun to do, honestly. But anyway, thank y'all for watching. This was the final episode of Dead Rising 2. I hope y'all enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. We did it. We're done. You don't got to see Dead Rising 2 for a little bit unless it's a multiplayer video, which got to wait until Red's up for that. It all depends on how everything goes, though. He's a pretty busy, busy, busy man. So thanks for watching, and I will see you all in the next video.